Hi guys, it's Alexa. Welcome to my channel. As you can see, I am in my kitchen with some ingredients right here behind me. That's because in this video, I will be making a DIY pumpkin spice latte and then taking it one step further and making a pumpkin spice frappuccino. As it's fall, pumpkin spice is currently in season especially at Starbucks. Around this time of year, Starbucks makes a pumpkin spice latte and a pumpkin spice frappuccino. Well, I wanna try making a homemade version of the pumpkin spice latte and the pumpkin spice frappuccino that'll taste even better than the original. Let's get into the video. So right here I have hot coffee, milk, sugar, vanilla ice cream, pumpkin puree, and pumpkin pie spice. The store didn't have pumpkin ice cream, so I just got vanilla ice cream and pumpkin puree. Also, you don't have to use sugar, just use a sweetener of your choice. Now let's make the latte. First, you fill your cup halfway with hot coffee. Next, add two scoops of your ice cream, one tablespoon of your pumpkin puree, half a teaspoon of your pumpkin pie spice, and one tablespoon of sugar, and then mix. Because your coffee is hot, it'll melt everything into your drink, which is what you want. Once it's all dissolved, fill the rest of your cup up with milk, and then mix. I'm just gonna add a little more sugar because it's not sweet enough for me. You can add as much or as little of sweetener as you want. Now, you can either enjoy this right away as a hot latte, or refrigerate this and then add ice to it so that's an iced latte. I'm going to enjoy it right away. Now let's taste it. Wow, that is really good. Now this is what fall tastes like. I can taste the pumpkin and the pumpkin spice. It's amazing. Now let's move on to the pumpkin spice frappuccino. So right here I have coffee that I have frozen into ice cubes. You can use regular coffee and regular ice cubes if you want to, but I don't want to dilute my frappuccino. And I also have my milk, sugar, vanilla ice cream, pumpkin puree, and pumpkin pie spice, and some whipped cream to put on at the end. First, I'm going to put my coffee ice cubes into my blender. I'm now going to add an equal amount of milk few scoops of ice cream, a tablespoon and a half of pumpkin puree, half a tablespoon of pumpkin pie spice, and as much or as little sugar as you want. I'm putting in a tablespoon and a half. I'm now going to blend everything until smooth. I'm just going to add a little more pumpkin puree because it's not pumpkin-y enough for me. And one more pinch of pumpkin pie spice. I, now that it's all blended, I'm going to pour it into my frappuccino cup. I'm then going to top it off with whipped cream and add a straw. And here's the finished product. Let's taste it. It's so thick. Wow, this is good. It's so creamy and although the pumpkin flavor isn't that strong, it still gives me the fall vibe. This is an amazing drink. You've got to try it. I hope you enjoyed watching me make these two delicious drinks and I hope you try them too. These are perfect for when you want a pumpkin spice latte or frappuccino but you don't want to go out into the bad weather to go to Starbucks. If you like this video, Please hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications. I post new videos every Friday. You may also follow me on Twitter at Alexa underscore Gerard 98 and on Instagram at Alexa underscore Gerard. If you have any questions or requests for upcoming videos, please comment them down below. Thank you for watching. Bye guys.